Hey Libras, welcome to your singles reading for April. If you are new, welcome. If you already know me, welcome back, my soul family. I'll leave information on what decks of cards I use in the description box, along with how to contact me for personal readings. So please remember to like, share and subscribe. Let's see what we have going on for singles during April. What's going on with Libra singles? Okay. Ooh, here you are, ready to take the chance here, okay? So this is somebody coming towards you who's going to be fair, well-educated as well here, somebody who has a lot of information, okay? This is this could be like described as a doctor or a lawyer, a judge, somebody like that, somebody well-educated, somebody who has a lot to share with you, a lot to offer you here. Um, it could be you, Libras. Let's see. Ooh, the moon. So I definitely feel like they will be revealing their feelings for you here, making it known, being straightforward, open and honest about how they feel. This is deep emotions here. They may be scared to tell you. They may feel like your arms are crossed, so you're defensive or not interested. But because of the moon, that's what I'm saying, like they may fear telling you but I feel like um they're just misreading your energy I feel like you'd be quite welcoming of um this news that somebody has a secret crush on you Ooh, six of cups here some of you're like I'm not interested in somebody from the past okay this can just indicate a soulmate in a general reading okay so this person who has this crush on you um I feel like it makes them feel young and giddy rather than it being somebody from your past. It's just exciting and new to them. So enjoy it. I feel like they're going to make new memories with you or they have pictures or something like that. Prince of Swords. So this is Knight of Swords. This is rushing towards you. Um, this is somebody who um, is going to be open honest somebody who's very loyal who's coming towards you they know what they want okay with the six of cups but they know what they want and they're gonna come and get it right they're gonna let you know they're gonna reveal their truth to you here this is somebody very honorable and they're gonna shoot their shot okay six of swords okay a libra just texts me right now so if he's watching hello um moving forward with positivity and open mind, a positive outlook to the future. These sixes are good energy coming in for you, okay? Moving on to better times, better relationships even here. More honesty and clarity in relationships for you. So you've been through some bumpy times in the past with the Six of Swords, but the smooth waters show smoother sailing ahead. And just like a Libra, they have to multi-text. Oh my God, the tower here. <laughs> this is for annoying somebody, texting them too much. Um, this might be quite shocking to you that this person actually likes you and wants this relationship to go somewhere. Um, I feel like this is shocking news, life-changing news here. Okay, we'll see where this is going. You're shocked that they're interested, but I feel like it's positive and you're happy to move forward with them. Somebody revealing their feelings for you. Three of Swords. Oh, you're scared because of the... It's a fear because of previous heartache. Okay, that's fine. A lot of people do feel this way. That's why we need the Fool. Um, to take a chance, have a leap of faith and know that not everybody's going to hurt you. And I feel like the fact that this person is full of loyalty and honesty um, goes in their favour because I feel like you're able to trust them more. Three of Wands. Yeah, this is your ships coming in. This is what you wanted coming to you. So definitely be open to giving and receiving love. Don't let fear hold you back. 
Oh, now the Prince of Wands. You could have more than one suitor interested in you. Um, I definitely feel the Knight of Wands may come in and leave just as quickly. But I feel like the Knight of Swords, so maybe an air sign, may be a better match for you. Um, because... We know the Knight of Wands energy can be in and out, you know, just as quickly as they come, they will leave again. So if you do have multiple people after you before you get into any passionate engagements, you know, let them hang around, let them wait, because then you'll see who stands the test of time, right? And that's that Three of Wands there, that waiting as well, waiting for the good stuff, right? Queen of Wands now. So yeah, they'll have to step up their game. You know, if they come in with an energy of, you know, let's do our thing and, you know, don't let them do it <laughs> because they'll leave just as quickly. Um, but if you make them wait, they like that, okay? And it shows them elevate and ascend to meet your energy. They then become a queen, do you see? Or this knight would then become a king. So definitely making them wait for the good stuff, you know, telling them good things come to those who wait. Don't rush. There's a lot of rushing going on here and I feel like it brings up fear in you. You may feel like they're moving too quickly or, you know, they might feel like you're moving too quickly. So slow it down a little bit, you know. There's no speed limit. Good luck, guys. <laughs> 